what is going on guys welcome back to my podcast my channel and my content all three things together so if you're just tuning into this channel and if you are a hardcore mortal Kombat fan this channel is not only for you but is giving you something to enjoy so let's get on with it it boom just tweeted from at underscore poor guy who gave us the fan made mortal Kombat arm again title menu screen which looks incredible it kind of gives you this high hopes of them or netherrealm studios remaking all of the classic 3d games with mk12 characters or 11 characters but just a little bit something just give you like a little reference to the mk11 characters but being based off of mortal kombat arm again so make sure y'all like and subscribe and share this video with your friends and family because we got more Mortal Kombat videos to come in the near future. So let's get back into this topic, which is the most important one. Well, not really, just me saying that. So this is what Airphone did a great video celebrating the 30 year of Scorpion and Sub Zero rivalry created by at the underscore poor guy. Like I said, who was the person who gave us the fan made Mortal Kombat arm again title screen menu, which looks amazing by the way go check it out i've already done the original video so make sure y'all go like it and give this video a like as well so with that being said let's get into this video that he actually shared enjoy get over here Good God Almighty, that's all I can say. What a great way to show tribute to Scorpion and Sub-Zero, two of the most iconic ninjas, blue and yellow ninja warriors from the Outworld and the Nether Realms. So, shout out to the poor guy and shout out to Ed Boom for sharing this on Twitter and it definitely has my attention because when I saw this on Twitter, something told me to do a video on this and I'm glad I was able to provide y'all with this but like I said this is such a great tribute to Scorpion Sub-Zero both of my favorite characters and I'm surprised that he did not add the Scorpion vs Sub-Zero from Mortal Kombat vs DC Universe even though the game sucked but it does have its purpose of being part of his legacy despite of his ugliness I cannot wait until maybe like around October of them announcing the 30th anniversary of this franchise and this is pretty good this is pretty good <laughs> 